Yeah, December. Bloody Nora. Yes, December. My hair seems to have poofed up in the last week because I used a different kind of shampoo and my hair's all explodey wody and I may need a haircut soon. Because look at that. All I did was do that and now it's already exploded into a whole mess and I uh, just don't like it. So as of recording this, on the uh, right now on the 3rd of December, um, I'm cu I've currently still not uploaded the trailer for the Christmas special and I've only just edited the New Year's special. Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces past and I miss you. School days, fun. Also, my, my, my new mic turned up about a week or so ago, and it's cheap, it's tacky, but it gets the job done, and that's all I'm happy about. And it really is good for Dalek lines, so if you ever need Dalek lines, email me, or just even drop a comment down below, and I'll direct you to my email, because I love doing Dalek lines, and anyone who wants me to do Dalek lines for them, for any production, I'm fine. I'll, I'll, I'm up for it. And this kind of microphone, because it's old and it's broken, it, it, it adds to the distortion in Dalek lines. I might actually put an example after this of my Dalek lines, and I'll also put a link in the description where I've done Dalek lines in the past. Talking about gaming stuff, Stuff. I could do like playthroughs of some PlayStation games. I still have my capture card as much as I use it But I still have it and I could do some videos on that. I've got to say this is a really good game I recommend anyone to pick it up from uh, CEX or game or anywhere really it is a really good game and I love its pieces I've been playing it a lot recently and I might actually do a playthrough on it um, And it's something I would definitely do a playthrough on because I love the game I love the look of it and uh, I mean obviously I'd have to replay a lot of it I just still find that fun because I still love this game along with spider-man 2 Yeah, there's also Resident Evil 5 after Resident Evil 4 that I could play but that'll have to come in a long time Like all of this is gonna come in a long time But hopefully we'll eventually turn up at some point the beauty of doing gaming videos is that I've got so much variety I could pick I could choose from. You know, you've got Little Big Planet, LA Noir, Saw, you know, all these different games I just haven't played on the channel yet, and I'd love to do that. I mean, a lot of them I've already played anyway, but there are a lot of them that I'd love to play. Like, I'd love to do um, a Grand Theft Auto thing at some point uh, on PS4 when I get my controller, because the charging is broken on my controller at the moment, so I'm going to have to get a new one eventually. Maybe that'll be a Christmas present. Um, but uh, Red Dead Redemption is definitely something I'd play on the channel. It's not something I could play on my own, because I could never get into it, but with a video I feel like I could, because it'd just be driving me on and it'd be a nice force. Saw is a nice puzzle game, I play like once or twice, but I wouldn't say I'd do a full playthrough. And um, Gears of War, maybe I'll do a playthrough on that, because I have got the collector's edition, it'd be a bit of a waste. Area 51, Bioshock, Halo 2, The Thing, The Last of Us, oh my god, I would definitely replay that on my on my channel. I mean, I've already played it like twice, but I would, pl I would, play, I would replay that and um, put it on the channel. Oh man, there are lots of things I'd love to do on gaming stuff. A few Transformers, maybe even Spider-Man Way of Shadows. Maybe I'll get the PC version though, because apparently the PC version is superior. Says my mate Max anyway, he, and I don't know if he's telling the truth. Got Victorious Boxes as well, that's a game I'd love to play just once or twice. Uh, Silent Hill 2 and 3, I'd love to play those. Call of Duty, Black Ops 1 actually. Hmm, that's odd, didn't know I had that where you can get them really. If anyone can tell me how to get these capture cards for DS stuff, I'd definitely be up for finding it because then I'd, you know, as long as it's cheap, I could do videos on these things. But again, DS isn't really that interesting, so I don't know if anyone would care. Howdy. Can you hear me? I thought I'd take some time to show you what books I've read this year because in the last six months, I've actually got into books a little bit and I've actually enjoyed reading this. This took me the longest, this took me three months, and this is the extra two months. Um, uh, this took me three months to read because I wasn't reading it as much as I could have. I was mainly just reading it at school in the sort of 20 minute Friday, so I can only read this every Friday <laughs> at school because I wasn't entirely into reading at this point, but I got into the book and I really liked it. And I've still got to give this back because this isn't mine. Uh, this I bought myself a little while ago, like I think a couple of weeks ago actually. But the thing is I've, I've, I've already read it in class, so I've, I've, I've technically already read it. And I, I probably will read it just before Christmas because why not? City of Ghosts I read within two weeks because I absolutely love the genre. And the writer, she's absolutely amazing. I, I, really, I love Victoria Schwab. Victoria Schwab is a pretty cool um, writer. Um, and then we have Stone Cold, written by Robert Sh uh, Robert Swindles. I, I, I didn't really like the book to begin with. I, I was really sort of 
bored by it very quickly. I was just sort of like, hmm, is this, is, this, is this all good? Is it? Is it really? You know, because um, it wasn't just, it wasn't my cup of tea, but I, I read it anyway because I, 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 I like the thought of um, a murder. So these are the books I've read in the last six months and probably will be for the, for the year so far. Right now I'm reading this, Your Turn to Die by Sue, Sue Wallman. And this is literally my readings for the next year. Uh, this is meant to last me a whole year. Um, this is Doc 2 and the Cybermen after this. Hi guys, welcome back. Um, I'm being a bit quieter because everyone's asleep for once. I just wanted to record more for the vlog. I'm very yellow because of the light here. Not much has really happened. We're nearly at Christmas. Unfortunately this year we've decided not to put the tree up because we just can't be bothered. Unfortunately, so this year is a bit of a bummer on Christmas. But I did just eat um, a, a, a massive, like with my, fa with my whole family, a uh, cheese board. We got cheese board, my sister ordered cheese board with the cheeses and meats and it was really nice. I did take a couple of videos, so I'll play that now. Yum yum. There's barely any cheese left. And yeah, it was, it was really fun. And yeah, I'm yet to have a haircut and yeah. I'm probably going to see if I can get a haircut soon, although my hair seems to have flattened itself <laughs> since I last like recorded for a monthly vlog in this way, like standing up with the camera in front of me. I don't know if it's simply because it's not down here or up here, I'm doing it level to myself for once because I'm just resting my arm here. Good day, I went to Canterbury yesterday and I just went around shopping really and here's a lot of footage. I did take a lot of footage so yay, you get to see me outside. I also got this little necklace thing that says J for John and I'm wearing it because I like it. It's fun. But anyway. Hello, it is now the end of 2018. <laughs> this year has been a bit of a weird year for me. I've actually got a light on my camera here. I think that's the new update that just happened recently for the, the Samsung phones. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, it's been a bit of a weird year. It's been a very quick year. I think that's because I'm going to secondary school and time seems to be just going, whoosh, you know, like that. Literally, it feels like it was yesterday that I said, Happy New Year, you sexy motherfuckers. Because I remember that, I remember that very clearly, and I remember doing that, I remember being in my room, saying those words, and uh, talking to you a lot. And, um, yeah, and I feel like I've physically aged, like I can see a lot of lines in my face, and I've looked back at some old videos, and I look a lot younger, <laughs> which worries me. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's the end of 2018, and I've got Series 2 being made at the moment, I'm currently editing Episode 5. And uh, yeah, I'm nearly done with that. And I'm probably gonna have to take a break from that because I'm still waiting on lines for that. So I can just I could just do episode eight. I just said the title name. I'm gonna have to edit that bit out. But yeah, um, I go back to school on the third. That's um, a problem. I don't want to go back to school. I really don't. Um, but yeah. Anyway, so yeah, that's pretty much it for the end of this year. Um, I had a blast, and I will see you in January. And maybe I'll do another Happy New Year, you sexy motherfuckers. Maybe, maybe I'll do that, and I'll put that in the January vlog. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Anyway, bye guys.